this exhibition, The Bride and the Bachelors, explored the multiple levels of engagement between Marcel Duchamp and a quartet of American masters, John Cage, Merz Cunningham, Jasper Jones and Robert Rauschenberg. Uh, they, they met at the end of the 50s, they were very important for each other, and in many ways you can say that the figure of the older artist, Duchamp, allowed them to pursue with their works, gave them the permissions to, to keep on with their practices. It's very hard today to think of contemporary art without thinking of Marcel Duchamp. He, he seems to be everywhere. Uh, uh, and in order to understand what his effect on contemporary art is, I felt that it was very productive to concentrate on this particular moment. At the end of the 50s, Marcel Duchamp was still not so well known. He got in touch with these four younger people, they embraced him, and that was the moment in which you see Marcel interacting with the younger generation. The exhibition includes many masterpieces by Duchamp, uh, several of them coming from the Philadelphia Museum of Art, which has the largest collection of his work. There's many other wonderful works of art by the four other artists in the show. It's wonderful paintings by, uh, and, and sculptures by Jasper Jones, uh, Rauschenberg, uh, the opportunity of looking at the performances of Mark Cunningham material are precious, and the music of Cage is, is present very strongly in the show. Duchamp is considered a forefather of conceptual art, and, and certainly for Duchamp ideas were very important. But I would say that Duchamp as an artist uh, went, you know, was a very complex uh, individual and uh, I, would, I would resist the temptation to reduce him to this or that uh, tendency, this or that movement. In an exhibition like this, uh, the challenge is how to combine artworks with uh, objects that were not originally thought of as artworks, like stage sets, with live dance and live and recorded music. It's an exhibition that happens in time. Um, it's not all there for you. You need to spend time with it. And hopefully people will visit it several times and they will hear different things and see different things when they come. Probably uh, the most important work by Duchamp was his use of time. Uh, and I believe that, uh, that time itself uh, is very present in, in, in this show.